a few years ago, I read a book by a guy, his name was Simon Sinek, and his, the book is Your Why, Knowing Your Why. And I might be saying the title wrong, but the point of the book is to figure out why are you doing what you do? What's the reason? What's your motivation? What's your drive? What's going to keep you up when you're exhausted and you're tired? And I love that book, and it made me realize something. Without knowing your why, you don't know your purpose. If you don't know your purpose, then you're always working on someone else's. Let me give you a story. When I was a toy designer and I worked on the McDonald Happy Meals toys, I remember I would come into work and I'd always say, hey, okay, we got a new project. We're going to make commercials. We're going to design toys. And in my pitch, I would always say, hey, I'd like to do little brown boys and girls. I'd like to do black kids. All the kids we presented were always white. And my boss would always tell me no. But I tried to be persistent. I knew it was important. I knew representation even in 2000 and. Eight, nine was important, 2004, five, six, whatever year it was. I knew it was important. And so I thought that I can get inside and make a change, that if I can get a job in the industry, I can make a change. And it went all the way back to me being a kid, trying to make my own coloring books, my own comic books, whatever it was. But the answer was always no. So years later, I realized, man, I can't make a change here. It was taking me too long. There were too many names I had to go to and ask and beg. And the answer was almost always no. This client won't like that. This will never pass. Whatever pitch we were doing, whatever movie the toys were for, whatever cartoon, it was always no, no, no. And so I stopped begging people and I started creating my own content. I started making my own books. My why was I had to make books so little boys like me, little girls like my sisters, would have something that represented them and allow them to build self-esteem, to let, to let them know that there's a place in this world for you. I, I couldn't figure out an artist. I couldn't find an artist when I was a kid. I didn't know how to be an artist. I didn't know how in the world could I ever grow up and become an artist. How is that possible? Well, now I'm going to give somebody else a why. I'm going to tell them that, yeah, that talent you have is a purpose for it. It's not so you can go and work for everybody else and serve. Yeah, having a job is cool. I don't have a problem with that. But sometimes the talent you have is so you can start something new. So you can tell a story that wouldn't be told. And we happen to live in an age where that's possible. Not only is it possible, it's plausible. So what's your why? This is my why for the kid I used to be.